let's look at how we name these compounds. And these compounds are called binary compounds. A binary compound is a compound that is made up of only two atoms. So first and then a second atom coming together forms a binary compound. So in our subsequent ones, there are, there are actually rules to name this. So let's look at just F. the rules to name binary name binary compounds. Because they are made up of two elements or atoms coming together, you realize that the first element is always a metal. That's a cation on the plus. Then the second one is a non-metal. So when you are naming, you, you maintain the name of the first element. So the metal, you maintain the name. So maintain the name of the first element. That's the meta. So the next one is you go to the second element and what you do is you drop the last four digits in the name of the second element the last four, last two, or last three, and you replace it with the suffix I, D, E. I, D, E. So you, you, are, you are maintaining the first name of the, of the element. You have it. The second one is you keep the element, but you drop either the first four, sorry, the last four of, or the last three, last two of the element name, the last name, then you replace with I, D, E. So a quick example. Let's say we have lit L like this. Li is plus and then a chloride minus chlorine is this here. So this and then this, they are the same. So it will form L, I, C, L. Now the name of this is lithium. Because the you maintain the name of the first one. This is a metal lithium. And this is chlorine. Here you drop the last three digits in chlorine. The last three digits in chlorine. That's the I N E. Then you replace it with I D E. So chlorine becomes C L A. So instead of lithium chlorine, it becomes lithium chloride. We can have several of them. Let's take magnesium. Magnesium and then chlorine. Magnesium is in group 2, so 2 plus is here. Chlorine is minus. So here I said we interchange. So we are going to get these two coming here, this one coming here, but the one we don't try. Don't, don't forget that we don't add the charges. So here is MgCl2. Now this is magnesium. Just I start mag magnesium, and this is chlorine. So it becomes magnesium chloride. Let's say we have um, let's say we have sodium. And then we have oxygen. Sodium is plus one. Oxygen is minus two. What will happen? Let's say we will interchange this way. So our sodium is this. We maintain the name of the first element, that's the sodium. So sodium, then this is oxygen. You drop the Y G E N, then we place I D E. So it becomes sodium oxide. I believe it's clear. Sodium oxide. You can have magnesium, magnesium, and then sulfur. Here, magnesium is 2 plus. 
Magnesium is two plus because in group two. Sulfur is group six, so S two minus. What happened? Because this and this are the same, they will cancel out. You are going to get your MgS. This is magnesium sulfur, but it's magnesium sulfide. So this way, magnesium sulfide is, I believe, it's clear. So we can have a whole lot of binary compounds and name them because they are made up of two atoms you can have the first one maintain the name of the metal we know then the second one as a non-metal we replace the last four digits in the name last two or last three with ide so